Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repairs. Uh, quite a bit of work going here at the shop, guys. Um, we've been taking that Ford apart all the way. You can see a uh, timing belt replacement here, guys. Half of the engine had to be replaced for that. <laughs> had to be removed, I mean. Intake had to be removed, and let me show you now why. If you have a Ford 1.6 EcoBoost, they use, you know, kind of vehicles like Ford Fusion Fiesta, Focus, C-Max, S-Max, Transit, Galaxy in England, all of them. You have to remove the starter here, guys. And this is because you have to install, there is a special tool that holds the, crank uh, uh, the crankshaft, actually, the flywheel, and prevent the engine from turning over. Also, on the back side of the engine, right here, there is a... Okay, there is a pin. Okay. Okay, this black thing, right there. Okay, let me just grab the phone quick with the other hand. Okay, this black thing right there, this is a top dead center pin. You install that one, so you can bring the engine in top dead center. Now, on the back side, okay, we're going to have a very detailed video how to do the whole job on auto repair, guys. It will be probably an hour video, everything. But just a quick video here. On the back side of the camshafts, we use that holding plate here, and on the front side, there is another one. So you can see how many special tools you need for that EcoBoost. Now the pulley there, it's no pin pulley, so that's no fun. You have to get everything right, or your belt will, uh, will get loose, you spin there, hit the valves, you're done. So make sure that you get all that done correctly. Now this is the tensioner and there is a special tool that holds the tensioner. Okay, like that, so you can install it and after that you just pull it and it gets everything tight there. Once you know what you're doing, not complicated procedure, but it's quite a bit of work. Just a quick video guys to show you that. Thank you for watching and see you next time.